We're back at Maywood Park in Illinois, where the two-year-old filly pace of the Breeders' Crown is still ahead. It's expensive to outfit a, a pacing filly or any kind of a racehorse, in fact. But not all the pieces of equipment cost a lot of money. A couple of cents for some of them, but they certainly can be vital. Here's Jim with a look at one. Most athletes wear several pieces of equipment hidden from the public's view, and harness racing is no exception. The tongue tie, and the purpose of this is to keep the horse from swallowing his tongue. The groom is tying down the tongue right now, this six-year-old pacer, and mind you, it's not painful, it's perfectly normal to do this before a race. Let's listen to a further explanation of the tongue tie from thoroughbred trainer Dick DeStazio. Well, some horses have a uh, propensity for getting their tongue over the bit, and by tying it down, it prevents that, and, and the horse only has just the, uh, the nasal passages to breathe through, and we want to make sure that the breathing apparatus is as clear as can possibly be, and what would happen is they put the tongue over the bit, and when the boy goes to take a hold, and they would push the, the tongue way back in their throat, kind of block the wind passage. Next visit to the track, look for that small piece of cloth visible in the horse's mouth. We are still uh, looking forward to the two-year-old filly pace. Many of them will, will be wearing tongue ties. One of these fillies uh, will be driven by Bill O'Donnell, who we will be watching for.